Scorpio. Hey Scorpio, welcome back to my channel. And this is the week ahead reading for the sign of Scorpio. If you're new to my channel, I pray before each and every one of my readings so that way my energy is protected, your energy is protected as well. If you're returning, thank you so much for returning. So the first message we have here is massive realization. Wow, there's like a rush of energy coming through with this card here. Your person has been doing a lot of thinking lately, Divine Feminine. And most of this is about you, your connection, and why there is still such distance between you. This can also indicate that you have been at a distance for a very long time or just way longer than you expected. The masculine in your energy field is someone who's been in the dark for a long time when it comes to you. And this is by choice. There are certain aspects of your connection that they would rather not know about. But there's two sides to them as well, okay? There's the one that you see and you know and love. And then there's the side that they would do everything in their power to conceal from you. Simply because of what your energy does to them. I'm getting that you really wonder why they have such an intense reaction to you. And it's because subconsciously, they know that there are some powerful truths about themselves that are connected to you and your connection. I'm also getting that they are the ones who actually initiated this separation. But what's interesting is that they don't know why. There's something about your energy specifically that makes them behave in ways that are extremely impulsive and maybe even out of the ordinary. They feel as if something really confusing takes place when both of your energies align or maybe when you're in the same place, okay? For some of you, this can even be just as intense over the phone or when there's any form of communication initiated. But your person seems to be having an adverse reaction to your energy. But there's also this heavy pull coming from them as well. So this may be a very confusing time for your person and just for the overall energy of your connection as well. Because there's something you're doing, Divine Feminine, that your person finds irresistible, but it also makes them pull back at the same time. And the way their energy is coming through they feel as if you're causing them to have such an intense reaction to you. For some of you, you're actually aware that your energy has this effect on them. But for others of you, you actually have no idea, but you can feel it and it makes you really curious to know why they respond to you in this way and what it is specifically about you that causes them to have this adverse reaction to you. So if you're wondering how they're currently feeling about the status of your connection, they're realizing some things that they didn't want to see. And this could be happening in a way that they can't really control. So I feel like this energy or this reading is definitely tapping into their mental and emotional process at this time and kind of giving you a closer look at the kind of thoughts that they're having about you, Divine Feminine. Okay, let's get the next message here. Okay, so the next message we have is you aren't the same. Hmm. Divine Feminine, I'm getting that you are way more spiritually inclined than your person. And because of this, the universe has this way of letting you know things that are still happening behind the scenes. But I'm getting lately, things have been oddly quiet. This connection is beginning to feel very different to both of you. You once had a very powerful energetic bond, something that kind of grew way beyond what you were expecting. But in the recent past, it feels as if the energy has shifted in a major way. Like there's been some form of like this energetic downgrade. You may even feel as if you and your person are being pulled in two different directions at this time. And this is what actually has their attention. 
So although you may be at a distance, your person feels like there's something you're currently doing that has not only caused a major shift in the energy, but it's making them more alert. It also has them thinking of you after a period of not feeling so close to you. And so at this time, they're really trying to read into your words or your actions a little more than they usually would to figure out what is attributing to this shift. Divine Feminine, I'm also getting that you've changed in a major way internally. There's such this calm energy coming through, but also a level of assertiveness that your masculine can pick up on. This may also play a part in why things have been silent for as long as they have. They can feel you, and there's such an emphasis on their approach at this time. It's something that you may think about a lot. But you would be surprised that they think about this as well, and maybe even more than you. But what's being highlighted here is that they're not okay with where you are right now. There's a lot of energy coming through about this separation. It feels different to your masculine than any other time, okay? And they're feeling these emotions so intensely because they initiated it. This was not a mutual decision, okay? This is something that they did impulsively because they are extremely sensitive to your energy. And this currently has them questioning everything. They're wondering if the actions that they took have caused this change in your energy or if they kind of pushed things too far this time, okay? But they can definitely feel that you've detached from them in some way, which is really heightening the emotional aspect of this. And kind of has them doing some soul searching as well. Because honestly, they feel heavy regret at this time. This is why the pull has been so strong towards you. Because you have them reconsidering their actions in a major way. In the past, this masculine definitely took the position of sitting back and kind of allowing things to unfold in a certain way. But for some reason, their current energy feels very serious, very forward and very, very assertive, okay? And they also feel like there's something that you're doing, Divine Feminine, that's causing them to react to your energy this way at this time, okay? Let's get the next message here. Okay, so the next message we have here is, you were right about me. Hmm. So if you're resonating with this message so far, your person has absolutely been suffering in silence. The way this energy is coming through is as if you tried to tell your masculine something about you, your energy, or your aura. Maybe you didn't say this verbally, but you knew that this time away from you would pull on them in this way because there had been some truths revealed to you about the purpose of your connection. You also know, Divine Feminine, that you are a huge trigger for them due to what they have experienced in life and love. And being away from you has only heightened this truth, okay? So when your person initiated this separation, you knew that they would be back. Not only because of how magnetic you are, but because the energetic bond you share allows you to have a deeper access to their heart space. This is someone who has always viewed you as a light in their life. And you have this bizarre way of highlighting a part of them that they often neglect. And now it can't be ignored anymore because you are the feminine aspect of their being. You also highlight a part of them that they were taught to repress. And this is also why other feminine energies have never had the ability to garner this type of reaction from them. And this may be something that has become super evident during this separation. This is also another reason why they feel like you aren't the same because you naturally operate differently than everyone else. You are the type of feminine energy that never speaks to their ego. You only speak to their soul. This explains the uncontrollable pull towards you that they can't explain. But this also explains why they respond to you in this way. If they were to speak to you directly from their heart space, they would tell you that you were right about them, okay? 
And what you knew instantly about your connection and this journey had to be revealed to them on their own time. This is someone who is also learning that you don't say things for no reason, Divine Feminine. There is always a deeper reason or a deeper truth when you speak. You are someone who has an incredible amount of depth and it's because you've seen a lot in your life and you also know a lot about the energy of love as well. I'm also getting that you only engaged your person the way you did because you got confirmation from a higher power to do so. And you immediately put this masculine in their own category. And for a while, you know, this made them feel as if they were in control of the pace and the unfolding of, of your connection. They definitely let their ego get in the way. But honestly, because they are showing up as this hyper masculine energy, they assume that this is what you needed or this is what you wanted from them. But they could have simply just asked you your opinion, okay? So if you're wondering how they view you now, they want you to know that your presence and your energy is very powerful. And they didn't understand what you needed or even how to respond to it. This is someone who feels like their body just reacts to you or they just say things that may confuse you and this is why but this time away from you has definitely forced them to sit on this and to really examine why you make them feel this way and the truth is because your light shined on the hidden aspects of them and you saw clearly who they were but also what they were hiding they definitely tried to build this wall around their heart space and you completely broke it down, okay? And it's not only that you see their true essence, you speak to it, you address it as if their ego doesn't even exist, okay? The way your energy is coming through is as if it is completely mind-blowing to your masculine, okay? They're realizing that you were not the cause of these delays. So this was really a, a reflection of themselves and not you. There's heavy projection energy coming through with this connection as well, which really has them feeling a little embarrassed and also very regretful as well. And also, because your masculine is working from a blocked heart chakra, they were unconsciously creating from this place as well. So maybe they, this energy that they were embodying was acceptable in their past, maybe for other feminine energies. But with you, it's like you hold up this mirror and you made them face themselves, okay? Which initiated this separation to begin with, okay? So even though your person physically, you know, initiated this, maybe they were the one who's, who stopped reaching out. Maybe there was some ghosting, okay? Maybe your person pulled back. But the way the energy is coming through is that subconsciously you became their mirror. You literally became the reflection of themselves. This, this is really, really powerful energy. Let's get the next message here. Okay, so the next message we have is, I see you everywhere, yeah. <laughs> The energy coming through with this reading is very, very intense, okay? So Divine Feminine, if you have ever wondered why your masculine responds to you in such an intense way, this is why. They feel as if they can't escape you. This is definitely giving you a closer look at what is hidden behind their silence. They are actually craving you, okay? Wow, I just got that clearly. And I mean that in every sense of the word. And what's very interesting is that they know that you know this. This is someone who comes off very strong, very bold externally in their appearance and how they carry themselves. But if they were to be 100% honest, you make them weak, okay? In fact, you may be the only person who has this effect on them. So even if they haven't said this to you verbally, their energy is very loud at this time. This is someone you also know very well, Divine Feminine. So they may have like a daily routine that you're familiar with and you know 
when they're thinking of you because you can feel it at certain times of the day. You both are aware that your connection is always active depending on how you're feeling. So there is this on and off energy coming through here. And this is both energetically and physically. So there may be times when you both detach, but it's almost as if the moment you tap back in, you are completely bombarded with signs, sinks, dreams, okay? And even telepathic communication. This is what your person is experiencing at this time. And they know that something in the air has shifted because something has them viewing you differently, okay? Something has them actually craving your attention, your affection, and even your acknowledgement, okay? And they're trying to figure out what to do with this energy, what to do with this rush of energy, okay? Or what it is that you want them to do with this energy. Oftentimes when this happens, it elicits such a powerful reaction from the masculine because they feel like it's coming directly from you, okay? Anytime where they feel things that they feel like they can't control, they go out, they see certain signs, certain things, maybe your birthday, maybe your name, maybe they smell certain scents, they keep replaying certain conversations that you had or, you know, they know that it's for a reason. And right now they're trying to figure out what to do about this. Let's get the next message here. Wow. <laughs> yeah, so the next message we have is we can't be friends. This is a very powerful connection, okay? This may be very specific as well because I'm feeling like there's such a level of familiarity that's coming through with this, almost like a really, really solid, solid bond or a solid foundation. This is someone that you may have known for a very, very long time, okay? Something very, very solid coming through with this here. But there's way too much attraction and chemistry for, for this to be casual. And you both know this, even if you sometimes try to diminish what you feel inside, but on a deeper level, there's something massive happening with the balance of your energies at this time. This is highlighting a masculine that is beginning to assume the role of the chaser, okay? This dynamic is shifting rapidly. And it's because you held true to what you know, Divine Feminine. And it's probably, that's probably one of the hardest things to do in this type of dynamic is to wonder if you're actually helping or hurting your person because aligning with your twin flame can be life-changing the only thing you know for sure is that you'll never be the same but you really don't have all the details the only thing you know is that you meet this person and you share a connection that feels very important to you your life and your personal journey you don't choose this connection it chooses you and the timing may be extremely inconvenient. It may come and cause tower moments. This energy is massive, powerful energy, okay? And I feel like this is the one thing that they want you to know at this time. And this is also what this time apart has revealed to them. This is someone who didn't know what to do with, with a person like you, okay? They have gone back and forth trying to make you fit into certain places in their lives, trying to understand why God would align you in this way. Why would they fall for you and not have all the answers, okay? Why would there be so many barriers set up? They know that this is a connection that they have to see all the way through because it brings up too many emotions and confusion when they try to make you fit into some type of category that they've created. This also explains why your no contact periods kind of end up being way longer than your person intended because there's nothing casual about this. It's explosive, okay? The energy is completely off the charts. And honestly, this is someone who has considered other ways of keeping you around just to see you or just to talk to you or just to have access to you in some kind of way because subconsciously they know that you are the one, Divine Feminine. I'm also getting that this is someone who likes to believe that they still have a pretty solid chance with you, okay? 
And the energy is coming through this way because there's been a lot of time and distance and space between you both. But for some reason, when it comes to you, it does not matter to them. So although they may not be sure how you would receive them after how much time there's been, this is something that they would like to see through. And they're hoping that you're in the same space as them as well, okay? This is someone who's definitely holding space for you, Divine Feminine, because this time away, it continues to reveal who you are to them. And it, it almost feels like it gets deeper and deeper, depending on how much time, how much space. It's like it's, it's never ending for them. It always reveals more and more of who you are and just how your energy is connected to one another. Let's get the last message here. Wow. The last message we have is, I really wish you knew this. Hmm. There are certain things that you did that literally still haunt them till this day, no matter the distance. And this is very, very specific to you, Divine Feminine. So this is the way you look at them, the way you speak to them. There's a very particular way that you do things with your person. And maybe this is just showcasing how you love, but it feels very personal and also very tailored to them and only them. They really miss this about you. You have this way, Divine Feminine, of navigating this connection that is very, very spiritual and very precise. It's almost as if you have studied your masculine and you're doing this for a very specific reason. There are certain things that you came into this connection looking for, almost as if you received a higher level of confirmation, but you still had to kind of do your due diligence to make sure. And this is because you have a massive heart space. And when it comes to love or just the energy of love and connection, this is an area that you really give your give all of yourself to. And this masculine knows this about you as well. So in an effort to get to know them, you accidentally expose the truth about them. And you picked up on things that they were not saying. You maybe even tapped into information that they were hiding from you, things that they didn't want you to see. You somehow saw them anyway. And this is why they respond to you the way that they do. This is why they are extremely cautious when it comes to your energy, because they know that this is so much deeper than they can even imagine. They were extremely calculated in how they engaged you in the past because your energy just comes off as very charming. They also view you as someone who is really easy to love, okay? But they really, really wish that you knew that they miss you, Divine Feminine, and they think about you often. And because their presence is so intense, their energy is just as powerful. You can literally feel when they are thinking about you or when they want you. And lately this has been amplified in a way where you both know that something is about to happen. So they want you to know that you were right about them. You knew that you would have this effect on them. And you also knew that they would be back once they figured out on their own who you are. This is how powerful your energy is. And also how subtle it is, okay? And I'm getting that oftentimes people may judge you due to how you appear externally. Maybe due to your culture, maybe where you're from or just how you present yourself. I hope this is coming across clearly, but you are someone that most people can only handle in doses. And this masculine energy definitely fell into that category. It's almost as if they're sitting back, thinking about the things that you said, thinking about the time that you spent with one another. But what sticks out the most to them is how you engage with them and also how you handle yourself in their presence. You really have this way of getting your point across without being abrasive. It's a very classy type of energy that you embody and it's very concise. This is something that they find very attractive and they really wish that you knew these things about yourself, okay? You have managed to hold their attention for way longer than they anticipated and this is making them want more of you, 
okay? I'm also getting something about questions. There's a lot of questions that they wanna ask you, okay? This is someone that values your opinion. They wanna know how you feel about them, how you feel about love, how you feel about life. There's just this energy of catching up, okay? So this is a very powerful, powerful energetic bond that may have felt like it kind of phased out over time. Maybe you felt as if you and your person weren't as bonded as you naturally were or as you normally are. And this is definitely because your person had to do some soul searching because they were extremely affected by your energy and they continue to be no matter how much time, how much space is between the both of you, okay? So if you're wondering what your person is thinking about you at this time, they're realizing that you were right. There was something that you did. For some of you, you didn't even say or do anything. It's just an energy that you embody where they knew, you knew that this was coming back around. You knew that your energy was way too much for them to kind of digest in the time that you spent, okay? And so everything that you knew within your heart space, Divine Feminine, is being revealed to them. And it's a lot, okay? They're realizing that they made a lot of impulsive decisions because of the power of your energy. And this is something that they're sitting with. And it's making them want you, okay? It's making them crave you. It's making them wanna reach out to you. It, they're assuming it's very curious type of energy when it comes to you, okay? So you may definitely feel them pulling on your energy because this is a masculine who is absolutely holding space for you. It's like, if you can see their day-to-day -day routine, you play a very huge part in this and you definitely have their attention right now, okay? So there are some major, major shifts that are happening because of the energy you are assuming because you have held on to this truth about who you are and also about who your person is, where they're assuming this chasing type of energy, wanting to get to you, wanting to reach out to you, okay? Very, very beautiful energy. So I'm gonna go ahead and end the reading here. If you resonated with this message, be sure to hit the like button on the way out. If you haven't already, be sure to subscribe to the channel. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye.